G'day guys, my name's Josh, you can call me Joel Woodle and welcome back to 7 Days in Update 1.0, but more importantly, welcome to the Wasteland. We've finally flown all the way north out to the Wasteland biome with massive cities, but also massive threats. But I'm out here, the sun is rising, I've built myself a little, a little tiny base on top of a building, so things could be a lot worse, and I'm sure pretty soon they will be. That's the proper sunrise, I'm going to need to quickly... Well, oh, yeah, there's traditions, right? We've got a balcony out here. We have a new base. We have to christen it. Take off all of you. Whack in my coffin. Good morning, everybody. Good morning, city. It's like the start of the Lego movie. Okay, I need to be careful getting out of here, though, because in the wasteland, there's always max zombies at all times. There's no respawn countdown like there would be in other biomes. So as soon as you kill one, another one will spawn immediately. Well, gotta get out there though. Tonight is Horde Knot. I gotta get back home. I gotta try and find a legendary part. I did build the roof of my little bunker up here. It was not really a bunker. It's made out of splinters and plywood at the moment. But I did make this little base uh, with the idea of the roof being a gyro pad. It's just about big enough to land on. Definitely big enough to take off from. Because you can just throw yourself off the edge and you'll be fine. All right, I gotta get down. Up, down to you. Down to you. Wouldn't mind whacking in some hay bales somewhere just to make this a little bit easier. And all the way down... There we go. Back down to the ground again. The new hazmat scans are always throwing me off. Perfume. Where was the other one? Where was the other one? The team five machete is still doing a wonderful bloody job. Uh oh, but I really want the T6. The doggo, doggo. Did, oh, I did kill him on the second one. Although, oh, yeah, I was going to say potentially firing guns. Oh, it's very green. Firing, uh oh, firing guns in the wasteland. Not a great idea. So I'm going to continue to do it. I need, like, the extended mag or something on the Dolce. Just the lack of rounds in there definitely made things a bit interesting. Quickly grab the loot. Oh, that was a tier 4 chainsaw and a grenade out of someone's pockets. Hold on. I'll take you. I'll take you. Why not? ScoMo, you want to hold this for me there, champion? Get a little bit of distance. There's no countdown. Right there. Didn't even die. Just gobbled it. It was like, nom, nom, nom. Thank you. Can I have some more? He knows I own a pizza shop. He knows where I set up my base. He just wants snacks. I've got to try and find somewhere to chuck down my gyro so I can take off and leave this joint. Yeah, you're all right. You're a feral wipe, but I reckon... If, oh, I was going to say, if I reckon if I get pretty lucky with machete here, I should be able to take care of it without calling in the rest of... E uh oh The rest of everything that's coming for me out here. Oh, there's a pigeon. That's okay. You guys are trapped in a little pen. All right, okay, I need to find a road. I need to find a road that's relatively straight. Get up in the air and figure out where I am. I still need that legendary path though. I'm still trying to get my tier six Shetty. Oh, hello, big, oh, hello, big fella. Yeah, he sees me, but I know that you, I know that you come with a big juicy red loot bag that I would like to take off of you. Quickly get, oh, missed it. Get you out of the way. I'm fighting a bear right now. Oh, damn it. I was trying to get away from him. I was trying to get away from him. There's another red loop back there, actually, so I could get a bit of distance to deal with you, but the white saw fit that wasn't going to happen. Double red loop back right next to each other. I pissed off some Muppets up at the pool of Vanity Tower. Red loop back in the wasteland. T4 fire axe. Some other stuff. And another one. I don't know where you came from. T5 steel shovel. Some more everything. I mean, the loot bags, at least. The loot bags here are great. It's not going to make that much of a difference, but of course, I'm going to change over that shovel. You can go down to there. I probably should... I probably should just get out of here. I probably should just get out of here. I've chucked down a land claim block on my little base in the, the, the western district of the Wasteland, which means I've probably lost... Was it you? No, you're still there. Is my, is my home base there? My home base is still there. Nice. You can have multiple land claim blocks. Oh, I lost one out in the desert. I lost one out in the desert, but that's okay. Wasn't really planning on going back out there anyway. Oh, man. What a start. Just, it's only been like an hour. Two hours of the morning, and I'm already getting my heart rate up. Who needs exercise? We can just fight in the wasteland. Gonna try and get the bird in the air before I get to the streetlights down the end. Easy as that. Okay. I don't really want to leave without my legendary part. It was half the reason that I came down here, but I'm not sure where to go to try and find the trade is worthless there's a lot of places around but they're all going to be absolutely chock a block with everything bad just being like the middle of the city in the wasteland especially is such a bad idea might try to go out to like the outskirts a bit and try to find anything when well, that's the thing that's a legendary part there's no like rhyme or reason to where you're going to find it so i guess maybe like a house like a house like a house is actually oh 
Because I've been finding them in suit jacket, like like the the wardrobe thing. So people have been telling me that apparently um, Savage Countries is the place to go. That's where you want to go to get legendary parts. So, okay. I'll listen to the comments again. I've learned this lesson before. Never trust the comments, but this time... This time I'm trusting you. Don't let me down. To give you just like a little sneak peek behind the scenes, it is absolutely freezing here today. Like my hands are chilly. I'm inside, the heat is on, and I'm still, I'm still shivering like a penguin in, well actually penguins are good at the cold. I'm shivering like a penguin without its fur. But I, it's just like, it's throwing me off. It's making everything feel slow and stiff and how you going. Oh, is that what I'm looking for? Is that a savage country? Yes, it is. We fly around for a little while to try and find one and finally found one on the horizon. Nice. Okay, plonky down. Yeah. So, um, look, it's hard to talk, it's hard to play, it's hard to do everything, but Horde Knight waits for no man. Legendary parts, here I come. Oh, you are, you are kidding. Oh, it's the shelves. It's the shelves. I thought they fixed the shelves. Damn it. Okay, well, I'll take my ball back. Thank you for nothing. A reasonable way around to get a better, a better angle on you. Already murdered the hazmat. Didn't get you down quite yet. I, where are you going? <laughs> yeah, fuck that door. How dare that door shoot you in the back of the head. All right, fair enough then. Can I get a second shot on you? I can miss the second shot on you. There's not that much ball drop, Josh. Don't, I can't shoot through the shells. Hold on. Is that going to get you coming back out my way then? Because I need you to be over here so I can get you. Okay, let him come. Let him come out here. Just wait for him. Nah, he's just, he's just got a vendetta against the doors. <laughs> All right, sick as. You know what? I may not actually have the time. I don't think I have the time to try and do this stealthily because I need to get out of here and back to my back to my base before the horde knots not so i might just gonna piss them all off and bring them all out the front there's more bears around that's okay are you are you the biker that i was trying to kill before i'm not sure that you are you were just a regular probably didn't need a copper 44 but oh man yeah okay the lag spikes of all the oh, of all the zombies spawning in again are definitely a thing gone nice good i saw another rat there is anti rating my dolce, so it's going to do a lot of work for me. While you're down, get your burning. Save some ammo. Beautiful. Although everyone's turning the blind eye. No one cares. Apparently the savage country were the assholes of the block. No one minds that everyone's dying over here. So it's supposed to be the clothes racks, right? That's, that's where I'm supposed to find the things. I mean, gone are the days of raiding here and finding all the different parts of clothing and scrapping it to so, so much cloth fragments. It's only like this new update where cloth fragments are so valuable because you use so many of them, uh, but you find so little of them now. It sucks. It sucks. You feel like fabric would be everywhere. Hey, buddy. Oh, you're the porcupine. You're the one that I was battering with arrows before. Oh, now you're battering me with your fists. Stop. Stop. No. Bad. Gone. Okay. Jeez, they hit so hard. I hate rad bikers so much. Um, oh yeah, probably don't need a full first take. It's a first aid bando for now. Oh man, they're the worst. Oh. Oh yeah, there's another bear outside. There is a bear out there and he probably has some red loot bags for me. I'll go and deal with him in just a moment. It sounds like he's eating a zombie at the moment. Oh, standing in a zo Fuck. It's nine o'clock. There's a gunshot in the distance, that's okay. Do, do I keep raiding though? I mean, I'm going to need more legendary parts later anyway, but that's going to give me my tier 6 machete. I just realized as soon as I saw a pop that I brought all my machete crafting stuff to the wasteland with me. I may, I, I could go back and get it from my base, or I could just hope I have the stuff to replace it back home again. That might have been a little bit daft. Can I not, do you not count? Oh, yep, yeah, you got to find the right jumper to search though. Grab you. All right, there's still more to go. Still more to go. If I can get some more legendaries out of here, I'll be stoked. Oh, that was a good, a good little haul of mods out of that. Tier 5 Nomad, Tier 5 Lumberjack, uh, Lumberjack? Lumberjack, carry capacity plus 5. So you're the same as my scavenger, but for light armor. Interesting. That does mean, though, unfortunately, the comments... Oh, for, I guess fortunately for me this time around. Uh, the comments were right, so I will make a mistake of trusting them again at some points. But no, thank you for that. Thank you for everyone who told me to go to the uh, the Savage Country to find the legendary parts. It works. I'm very, very thankful. But the next time you tell me something, I'm going to be equally as skeptical. 
Oh, I got another one. Oh, I got another one. I was too busy thinking about this guy coming through the mannequins over here. Nah, wait, leave her alone. Just saw some armor on that. Got another one. So that's two now. And like every, every new legendary part I find is another feather in the comments cap. And I just know. I just know they won't let me live it down. I can hear a lot of noises. What are you doing? I was going to say, you're just kind of standing there watching me. Oh, that's what the bubbly guys sound like now. Oh, I just landed square on her noggin. No, this is, that was just rather insulting. So the, the bubbly guys have a new sound effect now. They don't just sound like ScoMo used to. Or still does, I guess. Nice. That's actually really good. It's terrifying, but good. Can I... Are you right? Uh, hang on a second there, hot stuff. I think one of your friends has just slipped over. Did you just, did you just run inside and die? Did the snake eat you? Oh, there we go. There we go. Team Australia back at it again. Oh, another one. Oh, another one. I'm Nitro Express looting, so I'm not really paying attention that much, but I saw a pop. That's three now out of here. Savage Country is the way. I have seen the light, or rather I have been forcibly shown the light, and for once, one of my four eyes is working so I can see. Shit, yeah. That's so good. Savage Country. It was such a worthless POI before, but now, oh, now it's one of the top ones. I've gone through all the racks except for you, another armor part, and I have three legendary parts on me now. So I've got one, one in the gyro, I'm pretty sure still. So that's four. I needed five. Because I want to make tier six legendary uh, stealth armor as well. You can all go into them. Where, 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 where? Did I... What? Oh, there. <laughs> Hiding in plain sight. I've got four legendary parts up there. So one more. And I, I don't need legendaries ever again, really. I've got legendary tools. There were... I was going to say there's a bear back here somewhere, so probably want to take care of you before I get... Oh, you're only a little bear? You don't come with red loot bags. You're just a no one. You're like a little you're like a little cub. You haven't had long enough in the world to gather all the good shit. Oh, well, I mean, at least you're juicy and come with a bunch of meat, but <laughs> weirdly, at this point, I'm kind of hoping for dire wolves and, uh, and zombie bears. At least then I get the loot out of them. And loot's everything. Just trying to get through this back room as quick as I can. That's your head there. Nice, Gary. There's going to be a, going to be plenty more up on the roof. Oh, there's one then. Uh, up on the roof and stuff, but just get the loot room clear. Oh, that was a rat. I sat you with the crossbow, but... Oh, yep, you've got more. You've got more. I knew it was going to be on the roof, but I thought they were going to wait for me. I thought they were going to have some patience. SMG. Never let me down yet. It's not going to start now. Good God, they take an absolute pounding, though. Like a new Arlene. You're gone. You're all gone. All right, I fired guns. I fired guns in the way, sir. That was bad. Get the loot. Get out of here. I need to start making some tracks back up to my horde base. It's already midday. I didn't bring lockpicks. So we're going to have to do it the old-fashioned way. Who needs to get... Who needs to have dexterous hands when you can just beat shit to death instead? Pop open you. Reinforce chest for... Farmer, ooh, farmer boots. I think I'm only missing farmer gloves now. It's actually a pretty good level too at a tier four. Take that. I'll wear you to cook and chuck in you. Sick as I can make sledgehammers. Super stoked about that one. Bow parts, no thank you. Some ammo though. I said bow parts, no thank you. I said bow parts, no thank you. What the shit? What's with, what's with the thousand bow parts in the savage country? Is this like an archery specialty store? What? What? I've never seen a concentration like that. Grab the ammo, some brass casings, and as soon as I already finished, put my machete, machete parts. Not that I was concerned because I have so many of those back home, but was, that was so many bow parts. Okay, we're done. We're done. We came for what we needed and we got what we needed. You're still... Oh, I was going to say, is there a pixel in here somewhere that I can actually loot you? Place is empty. Place is completely gone. Let's get back on the jar and get out of here. So now we need... We need... Where am I going, actually? I'm going south, which is that way. All right, fair enough then. Um, so I need one more legendary part just to make the... Oh, that last of that uh, armor gear, but then that's it. That's kind of... And I might actually get it out of the horde, you know? I mean, there's a lot of bags that show up in the horde, so maybe... Maybe we could be done. We could be done. We could have tier six everything, and then... And then what? I guess we spend a week in the wasteland? I'm not sure. 
I never actually got around to setting up a helipad on my roof, so I'm just gonna have to pick a spot and whack her down. Try to line it up before I get to the snow though, just in case it's foggy as shit. That's not too so bad, actually. It's not too so bad. Its visibility is still relatively okay. All right. There's my house. There's my horde base. God, I love this place so much. This might be one of my favorite, my favorite bases that I've slept together. Don't land at the spikes, though, please. Right about. It sounded bad, but it, it should be fine. Uh, I get all the cubs out of you. I don't have... Look at my farm, though. I don't have uh, a dump chest on the roof. So it's going to take a little bit to get it all down again. Yeah, dude, I love this place. I need to sort out this shit, though. Like, it's all it's all pretty empty with how you go on. But for the most part, this place is sick. There was the motorcycle. I knew I left it at home. You can hold on to the gyrocopter then. I did all of that. Oh, I didn't. I didn't take the mods out of the bike. I could have had a supercharger on my gyro. Oh, I won't too late now. Too late to get miffed about it now. You can all go into them. Health goes into that one. And you go into that one. Nice. Okay, so I want to get that T6 machete on the craft immediately, if not sooner. Uh, so I need my legendary parts. I need wood, duct tape. Wood. Gotta need some more duct tape. That's fine. I should have the gums to do it. And want to seal the machete parts. Steel. Actually, grab it, please. Steel and machete parts. All right, look at that. Even with all the spares left over in the wasteland, still got bags of it back home. My doors and my battery bank are done as well. Thank you, Pastor Josh, for thinking of me. It's going to take a, a minute? I thought you we were going to take like 25 minutes, like all the other uh, T6 stuff. But only a minute to slap together a T6 machete? <laughs> I am not going to blink my eyes at that one. Not at all. Thank you very bloody much. You can take that one back, that one back. I'm going to start thinking about how I'm going to run my power. And actually, now I have my battery bank as well, I can start putting in my uh, like my power doors. I don't have turrets. I still really want to run turrets for this as they're running across them. That would be really bloody good. But speaking of things that are very good, you. Get out of the way. I need to replace you with something better. I very quickly need to grab myself some nails. I have a lot of nails, but some nails and some wood because I'm going to need some signs. Okay, I'm going to need a lot, a lot more then. Uh, can you just quickly make me up? Probably not that many nails, just like 250 or so. Then the rest of that can go back into steel because in here, I've started wiring, I've cleared it all out the cubicles and things. I now have a wall of switches and I'm going to need to mark which one is which. I think the bottom row for now, I've got extras at the top if I need it, but uh, I'm going to have to wire one of the YouTube electric fences outside. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. I'm going to have to mark these up. I'm going to have to mark these up so I don't forget. Speaking of electric fences, I kind of forgot. Uh, I've got you. I've got not a lot of... I've, not, I've got a little bit of force on, but not much. Uh, T6 machete is done. Great. Uh, electric fences. So I'm limited on forged line. Okay, I'm making too much steel. Weirdly, okay, that's, that's enough for you. I'm, I'm weirdly making too much steel. Uh, you, I'm going to go like 200 forged iron. Sounds good. The rest of that into steel again. Got bags of the rest of it. So I need to go and run. Oh no, as the thunder starts. I saw it. No? Were you lying to me? All right, the storm is still a long way off because it took ages for the thunderclap to get to me. Okay, so that up there, that's running fine. I'll probably even have that on a separate system to the rest of these. I've got plenty of switches anyway. It doesn't super duper matter. Plus, if I leave that up there, I can do the repairs to that one from inside the bunker. So that's fine. Uh, where am I going to put the... Re I could even... I mean... I could just go like this, right? I could stick it on the side of this little pillar here up to you. So it goes straight across there, right when they're like underneath that bridge. Although, you know, listen, listen, I'm in a bit of a pickle. I, I, I spent too long out in the waste and getting myself the uh, the legendary parts. At this point, that's one too low, one too low, but... Ah, oh, shit. No, I can't. I can't. It's not going to run properly. While I'm waiting for the next lot of electric fences to craft, do I have any money? I do. You've got sugar butts. You've got eye candy hackers. I was hoping for some more of the... Was it this one? No, not rock buses. That one. Skull crushes. Make my machete even better uh, again. But while I'm waiting for electric fences to craft up, you. Tier 6 machete compared to the tier 5. Modify that. <laughs> As the thunder gets me out of the outside. So, oh yeah, it's, I mean, it's better. It's not astronomically better, but better all the same. It's probably better on that decap chance with the hidden factor behind all the stat sheets is to lop off noggins even better. You can go back into there. I've got my uh, my motion sensors on me. 
You can come with me to run the rest of these. Idiot. I can't believe I placed it wrong. Why do I do that every time? So I've got my base electric fences already wired up. That's fine. You're on and running. So you should hopefully be charging some of these batteries. And the pathing electric fences. Can I reach you from here? Oh, I almost, I almost could have. I almost could have. I'm not giving up hope yet though. We'll try again. Grab you. Just a little boop up to the top. Nope, too far. I don't want my cable to go red. I need to stay black. So there. Can I reach? No, it's too far. Okay, well, that's too far. Ah, shit. Just run into that one then. We're going to have to rewire the fences out there, but that's okay. It's half past seven. We've got time. We've got time. No need to panic. Okay, I've got that running across there. I've got both those electric fences. You guys are good up the top. I've got two hours remaining. I... And I do have a shotgun tire, but shotgun tires are just so bloody worthless. They don't have the range. They don't have the fire rate. It's really SMGs or nothing. Like putting a, a shotgun tire in here won't help. If I'm just going to blow away my electric fences anyway, uh, what can I do with it? Can I do anything with it? Is it worth doing anything with it? I'm not sure that it is. I've got four more electric fences out of you though. Where could I run you? Where's going to be the best place to run you? Or should I, just, I think I'll just be happy with that. Just be happy with that. Don't try and overcomplicate it. Sometimes like this, less is more. Oh, and I can't, I can't just pick up, I can't just pick up my doors. Hmm, maybe I can like upgrade them to the electrical, like the power doors, but that's going to have to wait till later. That's not a priority right now. I actually just open you so all the zombies have an easy e uh, ingress so they're not going to break anything. Back up to you. Got an hour and a half. An hour and a half, no need to panic. Probably stuck getting all my ammo and shit together though. My horde box is chockers with... I've got 9 mil in there. I did take some 9 mil out to the wasteland, but got plenty of boxes left in you. I've got... I've got gunpowder. I've got everything but bullet tips, really. You've got no lead in you. You've just got clay. What's my lead situation like? Uh, do I even have any lead? I do. All right. It's not going to be done in time. We'll get you chucked in now for later. You have a bunch of fuel. I'll come back to you tomorrow. I need one more point before I can buy myself that physician perk that I will definitely need. I can't break my ankles falling off buildings anymore, but I can still definitely get them broken by the zombies. Half an hour. You chuck in be like 40 minutes worth of fuel, I think. All the way up. Perfect. 40 coffees on the go. You bloody beauty. I can suck them down tomorrow. All right. I've got food. I've got fluids. I've got repair kits. I've got learning elixirs. I am wearing... I am wearing my normal hair. Oh, wait. Hang on a second. Didn't I get... I've got the XP goggles. I mean, I've got XP goggles for my XP goggles. I don't really think I need to worry too much about my food and water usage just during the horde. So modify you, take out all of that stuff and whack it into that one instead. I mean, why not? Why not? Even more XP. That's like... That's like wandering around with a learning elixir on all the time. Oh, dude, that's sick. I'm going to load up the SMG with AP 9 mil for now because the Dolce, I've got 2,500 rounds of Dolce ammo. May as well. May as well use that first if I can. If I don't have any more. I got some ammo in you. I mean, you're sitting in a box, not doing nothing for no one in there. I'll take the regular grenades. Rest that can all hang out till later. Got so much 7.62. It's outrageous how much 7.62 is in there. Are you crafting? No, you're not. You're done there. You're doing good in there. Can you get some tips on the go then? Sean. All right. Time to head up. Time to head up. Let's go. I almost forgot. Almost forgot. Electric fence is on. <laughs> Electric fence is on, please. I got so distracted by everything else. I forgot about that bit. Uh, skull crushers also come with me to make my machete somewhat viable uh, for the horde. Okay, ready or not, here they come into my little bunk. Um, yeah, they're running through. They're getting zapped. Beautiful. And while they're sitting there, I mean, look at that. Look how look how smart I am by making the pillars uh, shootable. So they're not going to get blocked and block all the bullets. So now, when they do get a bit zappy, I can just sit here and scon some headshots. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. This is almost me doing something good. This is almost me being smart for a change. I'm going to quickly put in those skull crushes and also a recog, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold on, hold on. I'm coming. Got everything going. Didn't slice them up in one like I thought I might, but that's okay. All right, coppers are still going to have to die with extreme prejudice. Oh, because I need you to not vomit at me. You give him a tickle before he gets the kebab out, then you're okay. Nice. He's gone. There was another one down there somewhere. And boop. 
I may not have needed the skull crushes. I may not have needed the skull crushes. Bonzer might level up. Oh, shit. That's not level up. Big Bummer Zombies is complete, but I need to put my, my learning elixir in. I almost forgot. Shark, you in. And Shark, you're in. All right, we're good. We're good. That sizzly noise is going to go on all night, but I'm okay with it. Oh, it's... Oh, God. It's good, though. It's really good. Oh, that's a demo. That's a demo. I didn't even realize. I wasn't paying attention. I was kind of shooting into the crowd. Oh, God. The atmospheric uh, like lighting out here is bloody cool, though. You need to go. That was a demo. Okay. Need to pay more attention to where their nipples are because I do not want to explode my base down then. I think it should get a handle like a little bit. Like maybe one... Oh, didn't get there in time. One demo pop I might be able to get away with, but I don't think I'm going to get away with more than that. Get the headshots. There you are. There's, oh, that's another demo. Another demo. Get the combo before the demo gets them. And focus on him with the AP rounds. That's why I have it in my SMG. I don't think he's dead. I don't think he's dead. I think he fell back down to the ground again. He'll come back around. In fact, if he's down the bottom, you know what else is down the bottom? Couple of grenades. Chuck you, you, and light the fuse on the third. Down you go. Good luck, everybody else. Didn't get any XP pops. I don't think he was down there. He must have moved on. I got that skill point finally. Just quickly... Boop you, a boop you too, and while everything else is mucking about, grab you, position T1. Gotta cure those sprains instantly. That's such an important perk to have, so I keep getting punched in the face through the bars. Bonk. Oh, I've got the books now. What counts as close range for 44? Because I have the book that means that all 44s. Oh, fuck yeah. All 44s are AP now. But it says from close range, but I have no idea how far away close range actually is. I haven't seen. That demo come back yet, so who knows where he's gone. Bonk you, bonk you, scummo's up. I'm moving back and bonk is all again. Oh, the, with that book series, the Dolter is ridiculous. It's to the point down there that I'm, I kind of wish I built another grenade shoot. Oh no, that would take, um, I, you're not working anymore. You're not working, I need iron and I need electrical parts. Um, can you all please just hang out for a moment? I'll be right back. I'll be right back. You. Iron. Yeah, sure. Could you run to the other box? Grab my electrical parts and run straight back up to the roof again while I'm down here. They're not parthing properly because there's no way for them to get onto the second level. As soon as I'm back up here again, we're fine. We're good. Make sure I close that door before I fall back down it and upgrade you. Nice. There we go. We're back. We're back in business. Probably should have done that before the horde dice started though. I almost need a better scope or something on the Dolcha. I'm using it. I'm using it like a melee weapon at the moment. It's supposed to get all the way up to the top before I shoot him. But trying to see where the heads are now with that new uh, electricity animation they have. It's just so much harder to see what their head is and where I'm aiming. <laughs> we all know a pretty shit shot at the best times anyway. So making it harder for me, not a good thing. I still haven't seen a demo come up. I was going to say, I haven't seen a come back yet, though. He fell off at some point. Maybe he died from the fall, but I don't know where he is. Come back. Give me your pockets. My electric fence is down there, and now all cactus. Oh, there's no ammo in my gun. That would probably, probably help me a little bit. It does mean that they're going to be coming up here at a faster rate. So it lasted two hours of the horde. Wait for the headshots. Nice and nice and oh, Ali got a little bit closer. We're okay then. Even just some barbed wire or something like here to slow man. Uh oh, just that little bit would be wonderful. Give you a tickle, no more vomits. I'm like, I'm like the ultimate ant acid. You think you're gonna vomit? I'm like, yeah, nah, champion. I got you covered. Suck it back down and keep on going. We're all good. It's almost like a rifle base now. I'm just waiting for it to all line up so I can use the 44 to the absolute best of its ability. Shame. <laughs> he was right there. He was right there, not moving, and I still couldn't hit it. I hate me sometimes. Oh, I hate you more, though. I think you just vomited on my... No, no, shit. Damn it. Like, I've got the scaffoldings there, though, so I'm going to get nice and protected. Make sure you're fine. You're fine. And just use some AP ammo from range with a nice little cluster. No demos in there that I can see. Fast up. No. Oh, you cheeky. You cheeky, bloody self-detonating bastard. Not happening. Not here. Not ever. I might be able to. I mean, there's too many cops coming to really do much of my repairs anyway, but I might be able to get down on that second level and re damn it and repair those lower electric fences. I definitely feel like there's more, there's more flotsam coming through now that they're not there than they used to be. No, that's a fist, Josh. You want to go with a gun? Punching a, punching a rad cop to death probably isn't in your best interests. Could I reach you from here? 
I can't. I can't. I tried. I failed. Never mind then. Quickly run back up. I thought I could. I still want to put the, some SMG turrets in those windows. It's going to have to wait. Run around. And just charge up. Guns are blazing like it's Doom 2 in 94. Beautiful. Beautiful. I'm just repairing my guns while I've got a little bit of a lull then. There's a cop. Oh, I think you're like, you've been tickled before. So you're running a little bit slower than you were previously. Control your fire. Make sure he's gone. Just keep an eye out for the demos though when you're shooting through crowds like that. So now that like all of my guns... All of my guns are AP. If there's any demo anywhere behind the one that's blocking my vision, I'm just going to be stitched up. In fact, you know what? I'm going to keep you fully loaded. I'm going to go through 300 rounds of my 9mm and just stay with, stay with the Dolce. I mean, it's, it's armor piercing, what, like 10 meters? Like this whole little run here, this whole little path is still getting armor piercing happening. So it's actually better than I thought it was going to be. I thought maybe it'd be like two or three, but it's like 10. It's great. I'm probably better off for this. Just sitting back a little bit further, because then at least the coppers won't... Like, they're not going to try and vomit him from down below. They're going to wait till they get up to the top to have a crack at me. Because they've got more time to learn how to shoot. And then eventually, I might actually be able to hit you. There we go. Oh, that's a nice big cluster down there, though. A nice little bundle of joy to shoot through. Bonds are made. Got two skill points to spend now. <laughs> this, is, this is working out really well. I wish my electric fences could get fixed, but... In fact, is the top one still working? I don't think it is. Oh, there we go. There we go. Nah, it, it might not have been. I was probably killing them before they got there. I was being too good. Yeah, look. The, having the recog on the uh, on the Dolce is ridiculous. It does so much more damage. So much more damage than it would otherwise. And because I'm penetrating through them all, it's doing like, all this damage all the way down the line. It's carving them up. It's carving them up like a big chook of Thanksgiving. Wait on. Reload. Burp you straight through. The ones behind you die before the others. Make sure there's no one hanging out down below. Prime it with one. Fire it up with the next one. Might get lucky. Might not. Who knows? Didn't see the XP bomb. Was too busy murdering zombies instead. <laughs> it's just... This is working really well. It's just after three. There's a lot of pigeons that are going to caught up in the spikes up above me. I love that. I love that I can just put spikes up there and not have to worry about it. The day they fix that... Oh, bud. Oh, you copped a grenade, did you? Unlucky. Unlucky. But the day they fix those spikes so they're not nearly as effective as they are now, I say fix very loosely then, uh, will be a sad, sad day. God, these barriers are good. These barriers are good. The AP rounds are better. All the way through. A nice little narrow path of doom. Boop. Boop. And boop again. <laughs> I could do this all day. In fact, I just about have been. I'm not going to need to pop another recog. I've only got a minute left of it, but I've only got 20 minutes left of the day. <laughs> Use the zombies as a shield for the cop bomber. Thank you for that one. Everyone's looking out for me. Got three skill points to spend. I'm I'm flabbergasted that those nerdy, like that nerdy propeller hat, which still annoys me, doesn't spin. When you waggle yourself around, the little, like, the little propeller on your hat doesn't spin around, which is ridiculous. But like 20% extra learning out of you, plus the learning elixir. That's crazy. That's a crazy amount of juice you're getting out of all of this. Bonk, bonk, and bonk. <laughs> so this is great. The T6 Dolce was a great investment. About yeah, to be morning time. So as soon as, I mean, everyone I kill now aren't going to respawn. At least I won't do it in a second. Give me that shine. There it is, the wonderful piano. All right. Now it's like it's like Pac-Man's eating the orb. Now you're in my world. Now I'm hunting you. I can't imagine there's too many left. Oh, I, can, I saw the shadows before I saw the zombies. Just make sure there's no one down the bottom. Oh, chuck you down into the chutes. Let that pop it. I love that thing. I love that thing so much. One of my favorite things I've accidentally slapped together. I missed all those shots though. I was too busy thinking about the good age shoot and not about not about actually hitting zombies. That we're down there again. Chuck you down. Make sure I'm loaded and ready. Oh no, they moved on quickly. Maybe I am actually high enough to get them uh, to keep them out of the story everything mode. I never actually counted it. I just kind of hoped I was close. Boop boop. One more. And you should be the last one. I think we're done. I think we're done. I think it's all over. The first thing I'm going to do is turn off the electric fences because I cannot be trusted. What are we looking at? What are we looking at? We've got a bunch of loot bags. We don't have any red loot bags though. That's a bit rude. There was definitely a couple of demolishers that showed up. How did they not bring anything? They showed up to a potluck with nothing but an empty keg case. 
Bloody rude. Absolutely rude. But that's all right. I've got all the rest of this stuff to go through. But I'll have to come back and do all that looting. And I think, I think at this point, we're going to turn up the difficulty. It's not a great idea, but we're already on zombies are sprinting. Like, they're already on almost max difficulty anyway. So I think turning it up just that little bit probably a bad idea but it should be fun should be fun i think especially now i'm rolling tier six everything i think it needs to be maximum difficulty so i'll have to come back do the looting turn up the notches and see how we go for another week in seven days because this episode is done so thank you guys for watching most of all thank you to the patrons the patreon who made this episode possible if you liked it, make sure you hit the like button down below or subscribe to this channel Follow me on Twitter, but I'll talk to you there first. I'll see you in the next episode. Have a good one.